So we are getting ready to pop these. Shauna's got, sorry Shauna, several of them. Christina's gonna do the popping. Oh, that hole's got, the cup's got a hole in it. She just sanitized that needle. All right, Dominique, go hold her hand. Yeah. Sit down, yeah. sit down. Yeah. Hold Dominique's hand. You'll be fine. Hey, Google, turn off the music. Okay, Christina's coming with the needle. You already got two. Come on. We all good. Now, Christina's our resident doctor in our house. Okay, you guys sit down. Sean, don't make me sit on you. It's not gonna hurt. I know. I know it's gonna hurt. Hold my hand. Just a little bit. It's not gonna hurt that much. Okay. If you can't watch, close your eyes and think about something. Okay, look at me. Look at me, <laughs> sissy. Okay. <laughs> okay, go. That was it. That was all she has to do. Okay. No, stop. See, look, it's already coming out. No, I didn't. It didn't go in because you're moving. Okay, this side. Don't put a bandaid on it or anything. Okay, See? Did it hurt? I think, yeah, it's not. Did it hurt? Remind me, a little bit hurt? See, I told you, let's do a little bit, but it's not done. Okay, turn around. Turn your face. Turn around. 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 Oh, much better, sis. Yes. Shauna, yeah. was that so bad? I told you. No, just press on a little bit. Yeah, press on until you're all done. Was that so bad? Shauna, did I hurt you? Did I hurt you? No. See, that one's drained. Those two are drained. Yeah, one time. Turn. I'm going to You guys are weird. No. No, get this. Shauna. Okay, turn back on. No. Just, sorry. Oh, Alright, Sissy, was that so bad? Here, Can you say thank you to your sister? Thank you. Hi, I'm Shauna, and today we are making a gluten free box cake. The first thing you want to do is preheat the oven. We're going to preheat it to 450. 15, not 450. 415. Right there? Okay. Now hit then start. You press start. Um, you should usually have it at four three fifty. Three fifty, but our um, oven isn't temperatured right. Next, what you want to do is you want to grab your box cake and you want to grab a bowl. Use a knife, you weirdo. Careful. It's just like opening a popsicle. Right. And you want to pour it in your bowl. Next you want to crack your eggs. Usually you have three, but here's a hint. Add one more egg. Trash can. Make sure you wash your hands before you bake. After you're done cracking all your eggs, you need to wash your hands because they're salmonella. like her outfit so Shauna's got a pretty bad sunburn so she hasn't been wearing clothes so her dad made her a poncho and her little sisters painted it yeah. right next you grab your measuring cup first we want three-fourths of oil the three-fourths and the, the one-third <laughs> not three-fourths is right here we have vegetable oil <laughs> You want to make sure it goes to three fourths and nothing above. No, one third. One third. One third, not three fourths. Do not listen to the three fourths. Right there. Yep. And then you pour it in. The next step is, is you want a cup of water. So you're going to go to the faucet. Now, for the guys know, you can also use milk instead of water, but... We're out of milk. We're out of milk. My brother drank it this morning with breakfast. And I don't want to go to the store. Which I it's could. it's 100 degrees. 
which I cooked. I cooked eggs and toast. And then I cooked lunch, but nobody's eating it. We'll get them up here. After I'm done cooking. Next, what you want to do is clean up your space. You add the caramel flavor. How much do I add? Just a couple of drops. It's not open yet, so you're going to have to... Now, you don't have to add this. We just like it. Because it makes our cake good. We could have added cheese cream, but I don't like cheese cream cake. Ugh. My mom... Fun fact. My mom got a cheese cream yogurt and... Cheesecake yogurt. Cheesecake. A little bit more. Oh man, you can smell that already. A cheesecake yo yogurt. There you go. That's Except enough. Except they put actual cheesecake filling in it, and it was disgusting. My mom didn't even like it, but she loves cheesecake. Right. Clean up your spot, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a mixer. You could use any mixer you want. We're, we're using this because it's the only thing we have. No, but we have a Bosch. You have a Bosch. Mm -hmm. oh. You can use a Bosch, but it's... The hand mixer's just fine. But we're using the hand mixer because it's easier. Ow. So it's just a little sore. My sister popped my yucky blisters today. Okay, remember, whenever you're doing this, this is for all you little ones out there that want to bake for your parents. Do you see this? these little dots on the side? You want to line that up with the the course. line and that just locks it in there oh wait it's already getting hot in here yeah there you go but make sure you have adult supervision or adult permission don't do it without adult permission what you want to do is you want to turn it just a little bit You have to push the button. Oh. There's a button. Push that push. button there. Why isn't it? Ah! Hey! <laughs> you just want to um, get these out so you don't make a mess. Then wash your hands if you got dirty because I can't stand dirty hands. So you can use a cake pan or you can use one of these. It's a cake pan, it's just a different, not one of my fancy ones. You want to spray it with cooking oil because you don't want it to stick. Make sure you get the sides I too. <coughs> um, you can use butter to rub it down, <coughs> except um, the butter. <coughs> The butter doesn't work as well, so if you don't have cooking oil, you can rub it down with butter, butter and flour. Butter and flour. But if you use plain butter, it doesn't help. It sticks. <laughs> There's a bunch of baking shows that they tried and do that. You better get a spatula so you can scrape it out. Scrape it out. It broke. <laughs> I'm not going to hold your bowl for you and the camera. Sad story. Story. The spatula broke. No, your brother put it in the dishwasher and it got burnt. And then... Yeah, it got burnt. Oh. Hi, um... Oh. Hi, um... It's been a while because we were waiting for it to be finished preheating. So I cleaned up my space. And I was thinking of a joke. 
I said I'm hot in both ways. Anyhow, so. You don't have to use hot pads to put it in, sweetheart. Oh. Hold on, please. Set the timer for 25 minutes. I can't do it. I can't reach it. A cheater. Wow. It hurts. <laughs> <laughs> you see your arm. Uh -uh. Let's show the world your arm. You want a lot better. Ow! It hurts. Shauna, Lily, Sam, Hannah. You got this, sis. Hey, lots of water, ladies. Lots of water, please. I don't want you falling over dead on the field. Yeah, I was getting soaked. Oh, what's that, Sam? All right, Shauna, now you're ready. You got this, Sam. Good luck, Shauna. Good night, 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 Shauna got to run. Shauna, you did great. You, the whole team is awesome. How you, how's your sunburn feeling? Ouch. Hey guys, so I made today's video about Shauna because I am so impressed with her today, especially. You know, she's got that huge sunburn and it's blistered and just gross. And she went to her softball game and she played like a champ. And she also had, she did catcher. Um, I didn't get a lot of, I didn't get any video of her being the catcher, but she was the catcher today. And she had to put on all of the catcher's gear and the catcher's gear was touching her sunburn and it caused more, um, more blisters to form. And it was 102 today. So she was hot. It was hot. And, and so I just wanted to highlight her 
and her fun personality and show you guys just what a great kid she is. So today's video is dedicated to Shauna. Hey, do me a favor, hit that like button, hit the subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow.